Yo, what's up, y'all? It's your man, Federal, representing the band Federal and Company. Got a couple members of the band right now. Um, got my DJ, DJ Fatty Lumpkin. Dave on the bass. Cy, my drummer. Uh, you know, just uh, doing the Federal and Company thing today. Want to um, talk about how we came about and what it is we're trying to do, our goal and our mission. And just um, invite you to come along with us. So. What we started out was kind of putting this thing together almost like a puzzle. Um, Dave was the first guy I worked with him um, at a factory. I worked there about three weeks and I was like, I'm done with this. I called Dave, we did a show in my hometown and it went well. We sold out the crowd and it was a good response. It was just me, um, the bass, so we needed drums. And I called Saeed, my um, dad, and reminded me like, man, you gotta have a drummer. And I forgot that he had played the uh, church I went to when I was growing up as a kid to so call him and I um, he said he'd you know gladly be in the band and from there the DJ's always been with me um, I used to sneak in and watch him when I was like 16 or 17 playing at one of the um, more reputable clubs here in Dayton um, and he was just always just amazing to me so I just Approached him one day, I think he kind of looked at me like, who the hell, like, who are you, you know what I'm saying? He was but, persistent, man, he'd come in, and uh, I'd always see him there, and he'd always come holler at me, always come ask me to do the shows, and uh, I was always like, who's this little kid, but then I heard him, and I was like, well, it's on, so we just we started hooking up, doing music. About three years into the making right now, just completed our album, The High and the Better Sounds, you know, we're just doing the federal and company thing here in Ohio. Um, we have our own movement, Sounds Like Ohio. If you're not familiar with that, get get hip to it. It's us. Um, Seven. 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 Um, the structure of it is uh, lead, lead guitar, rhythm guitar, bass, um, DJ on the one and twos, percussion, vocals, keys. So uh, it's pretty much our foundation, our structure. Rockin' stadiums. Exactly. I have a bunch of stories, but uh, <laughs> it's a trip to West Virginia. Yeah. That... Yeah. Tara Alta, West Virginia, invites us out to play. Finally, leaving town, we're about to go play this big show. We were driving six hours from Ohio. We get there, we're pumped, you know. So, mind you, up the hills and down the hills and everything, we're there, we're there. Like, okay, so we finally get there, and I've heard a lot about this um, this festival, so I'm excited. So we pull up, we see this big stage left, you know, out in the middle of just lights and just rocking over there. I'm like, all right, cool. That must be our stage, you know what I mean? It's like midnight. So I'm like, oh man, he said we're going out at two. That's the best slot. So I walk up to the stage. I tell him, you know, Federal from Federal Company face draws a blank. Doesn't know who I am, doesn't care who I am. So I go get one of the guys I know from Ohio. I'm like, hey man, we're here in West Virginia. What's up? Where do you want us to load in at? Just take your stuff down down there. There's a barn. There's a there's another stage in the barn. Barn, like what the hell? Time goes on. There's a there's a band in there. They're, they got a, a little crowd in there. Time goes on. One o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock, four o'clock. Still no federal and co. Everybody's in their tents or sleeping. Damn near about to pass out, about to go to sleep, whatever. We're just talking up as a vacation. Since we can set up now, four people, four, maybe five. Sorry, there was a bartender still on duty. We're rocking for those people, but we didn't even care because it was just right. the fact that we got to rock. And I can literally look outside and see the sun coming up. Everybody's eating breakfast. They're like, man, you guys sound really, 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 really good. I'm like, well, how do you know you wasn't even in there? And it was like, well, up by the campsite, we could hear because it resonates throughout the park. And it sounded real good, man. Keep doing what you're doing. So that right there was just inspiration. Just keep making music and just keep grinding, keep moving. And if we can touch one, we can touch all. We uh, started a Ohio prison tour or whatever. Just our way of, you know, federal and company's way of giving back. You know, try to, um, anything to uplift or unite, you know, anything, anything. Um, but when we when we did the whole like Dayton corrections thing, um, a lot of us went into it not knowing what to expect. But at the end of it, you find like everybody 
everybody's human. Uh, album name is The High End of Better Sounds. And my favorite, hands down, is uh, number four, Bank Robbery. <laughs> hands down, yeah. that's my number one. That song's hot. My that's favorite cool. is Ultrasonic. Keep this pumped, keep everybody pumped up. It's a hype song. Mine probably is our single. Uh, the one we're pushing the most, Never Make It. Um, the one you guys will hear on radio here pretty yeah. soon. So uh, that's my favorite. I like I like the album in general, but if I had to specify one, I'd, I'd have to go with Bask in My Fame. It's real, real high energy, real, real tense. Um, it's a lot of passion, a lot of emotion, man. And you really can't help but to feel it, so. Themes for the album is either love or having fun. It's mostly love or having fun. It's like the two things missing in this world today is love and having fun, so that's, you know, that's what that's what we're missing from the world, so that's what we try to make and we want to spread that love to everybody else. Well we're kind of diverse, like it depends on the song. Um, I compare us a lot like overall to 311 um, or Beastie Boys when they were doing their band stuff. Um, that's that's where I think um, I could compare myself mostly to uh, those two. I, I've heard parallels to um, the gorillas. N.E.R.D. Yeah. Um, gym class on steroids because we're loud. Red, 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 Red Hot Chili, Chili Peppers, Peppers a little bit. Just a little bit of everything, but at least we're in good company, you know? Right. Uh, those are all bands that we love and respect yeah. and we would love to tour with. You guys need to open yep. so. <laughs> like Lump said, it's not that we're trying to fall into any genre, but for the, the fan, they kind of want to know what you can compare it to. And, those are things, those are bands that we wouldn't hesitate to say, yeah, you know, they're not lame bands, they're great bands, you know right. what I mean? And to be even considered in those kind of sentences or realms, that's, that's honor.